My name's Connor, and I've been working for Relicon Finance since February of this year. I'm Rick, and I have no idea how long I've worked here. This thing's unimportant in life. My name is Steven Suzanski, and I've worked for Relicon for the past seven months. Uh, what's my name? <laughs> no, my name is Clyde. I've been working here for now, like, from November 2020. Um... I remember that because I started around Black Friday time. So give or take two years, almost two years, almost two years. Uh, my name is Heath, and I think I've been working for Relic for about two months now. All right, that's good. Uh, how was your experience? I love it, man. It's the greatest thing I've ever done. My favorite gun is my FN Scar 17S. I worked so hard to get that gun, it shoots amazingly. Why is that your favorite gun? It's been a dream gun ever since I played, ever since uh, I played Xbox, Modern Warfare 2, and I've used it in every single game since then. 1911. Why? Because 45 ACP. It's just silly to shoot for. Uh, favorite gun I'd have to say, I own currently a uh, Cimarron Thunder or 45 Long Colt in single action. Why is that your favorite? Uh, as a kid, I always liked westerns. Um, always liked uh, revolvers. Tend to favor them more, and always like shooting a long colt, uh, forty-five uh, ammo. Favorite gun to shoot? I would have to say a handgun would be my Glock 17. Why? Ooh. So, my first gun was a 19. I purchased that because I was still new to guns. I um, went over to the 17 because I wanted something longer to shoot, and it was too easy to shoot. I, I got better the more I shoot it, more than any one of my guns I have, and it's, it's consistent, plus it's just a standard. Favorite gun would have to be a Beretta 92FS. Why? Trained a lot of Marines on the Beretta M9, and I just have always had a, a love for it. My dad initially got me into shooting. I. I was a big history nerd, so I knew a lot about the guns there. He got me started shooting. Uh, I was on my high school's rifle team, and that just kind of sealed the deal with uh, being interested in firearms and shooting. My dad. Uh, probably moving to Pennsylvania, coming from New York, couldn't do much of that. Uh, coming here, gun laws were a lot more relaxed. Uh, got into it, bought my first firearm, and then pretty much became a hobby since then for the past 20 years. I was good at it. <laughs> I realized I was good at it at, at... I started shooting in 2016 and the more I shot, the easier it became and it made sense. So I what? stuck with it. Got into shooting. I think my dad got me into shooting. Uh, my stepdad, he got me into shooting. And then ever since then, I just, I got bit by the bug. True. Lefty both ways. I, some say it's a curse. I've managed to work around it. Has it affected your shooting at all? Uh, not too much, only when it comes to specific type of firearms, uh, specifically bolt action. Right and right. Dominant eye would have to be my right eye is my dominant eye, but I am left-handed. Has that affected you as a shooter? Not anymore. Did it ever affect you as a shooter? Yes, I had to start learning how to readjust my uh, focus for my right dominant eye and shooting left-handed. I also can shoot right-handed uh, when it comes to rifle. Right and right. Right eye, right hand. I had it easy. So it didn't affect you in any bad way? No. I, um, I can't shoot my left hand worth a damn, and I'm never going to try because if I'm going to die, I'm going to die right hand. <laughs> right hand, right eye. Fact. How, how has it um, affected your shooting? Hasn't. Not at all? Nope. Nothing? Nope. All right, right hand. If I can own any gun, I would say a Staccato XC. I'm a big fan of, uh, big fan of like race guns. So that's like the cream of the crop for Staccato and I dream to own one one day. MG42. Why? Because it was butt so. <laughs> that's tough. Uh, probably right now at the moment <laughs> is uh, Rock Island Armory, uh, 45 ACP double stack. <laughs> Whatever sniper team uses for long range. Okay. Because 
it would be challenging for me to hit a target out even up to about 2,000 yards if I can learn how to shoot that and own it and be proficient. Mm -hmm. uh, I would like that. I'd have to go with the good old M1 Grand. The Grand? Yeah, just gotta hear that ping, man. Oh, man. Love to hear that ping. 